Hey everyone, just wanted to do a video on how to man manually push the letters together um, of a project within Cricut Design Space. So I'm going to go ahead and show you that. I'm just going to type out um, a sentence here. And I'm going to click a font that I know um, has kind of goofy letters just to give you an example of what I'm talking about. Botanicals. Let's go down. Okay, so with botanical font, you see how the R and the E are kind of spaced far apart, and I know why they did that, and it's because the R has this kind of long loop right here. Um, but I don't really care for it. So what you could do, of course, um, with a Cricut Design Space option they have here is push the letters together like this. However. As you can see, they get really close together on some of the letters and they keep this thing very um, far apart still. So, what you want to do to manually push it together is you are going to ungroup it uh, by clicking this button right up here. And that's going to separate all the letters. So after you ungroup it, I'm just going to get rid of that layer. Okay, so after they're ungrouped, you're going to just select some of the letters, the ones that you want to push together. Oops, that didn't work here. And group. There we go. So it separates each letter. So you want to take the little portion that you want, and you just, you just want to push it to the left a little bit. And you can have it however close um, or however far apart you want. And that's a little bit up, I think. So I'm going to bring it down just a tad. There we go. That looks better. Um, so after you're all done, go ahead and select all and click group to group them all back together. Um, another thing I wanted to show you, I'm just going to get rid of that, is manually moving like each line of text closer. Okay, so this font I guess isn't the best example. So I'm going to go ahead and quickly just find a different font. And I'm not sure which, where a good example is, but we're just going to choose one and hopefully it works. Okay, so you see with this how it creates kind of a large amount of space in between each line. So you're going to do the same thing with this as you did with the previous text. You're going to want to click ungroup. And just wait for it to load a little bit. And highlight an entire line. And just move it up to where you want it. And this is a great thing to, um, so you can be able to customize the projects you want. To have it as far or close together, or close up. Far to get, or close together or far apart as you want. And once it's all finalized, hit select all and attach. And then you can move it as a group again. Um, so that's it. That's how you would manually do it. Um, of course, they do have the size width heights as well as the um, selection for the text within the options there. Um, this is just the manual way, like I said. So um, I think that's all. Hope everyone has a great night.